<laughs> I think this bus is like a secret bus. A secret bus. Like that's like, like a like, CIA <laughs> bus. <laughs> the FBI bus. <laughs> Secret Agent Magic Boss. <laughs> Where are the hostages? <laughs> and yep. Safe bounds, everyone! Please let this be a normal field trip. I recognize this. I was a kid's that car a lot. I was a lot. This is my childhood in a video. This is quite the acid trip, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is this blowing your mind yet or what? Yeah, it's just everywhere. You baked into a pie. Time for Mason to tell us what he thinks the general plot of the Magic School Bus is. So I've seen one episode of this. Okay, good. Maybe that, that's two, not bad. but I only, one was about some like fitness mm -hmm. thing with the bus driver. Mm -hmm. But I don't remember what, how or what the bus was used for. Gotcha. So clearly from the trailer, they're everywhere. They're in space, they're in inside of people, they're in time. <laughs> like I think I saw one, something was in like, like a flabulent tube. Yeah, oh yeah. Dude. Like, wait, hold on, can you say that again? A, a flo wait, fallopian tube. <laughs> yeah, pretty, sure said, pretty, pretty sure you said flappian tube. <laughs> I'll flap your fallopian tube. All right, so. <laughs> so they're like, they're, ever, they're in volcanoes. Again, I don't know how they're not dying to the lava being that close. <laughs> They're in space, I don't know how they're not dying to the pressure. Yeah. They're underwater, I don't yeah. know how they're not dying to the pressure. Yeah. They're in a pie. Yeah. How? <laughs> like, there's so many limitations and I don't know what extremes this bus goes to. Yeah. Like, there's no oxygen, you can't breathe. <laughs> is, is the bus breathing? It has a face. Like, is, can the bus breathe in space, therefore everyone inside of it can breathe? Like, what's the limitation? So I, I, think I think you bring up fair points. I think <laughs> there was a bus driver. Correct. She must be crazy. Okay. Clinically insane. Clinically um, insane. I think this bus is like a secret bus. A secret bus. Like, that's like, like, like a CIA like, bus? <laughs> like <an> FBI bus? <laughs> secret agent magic bus. <laughs> Where are the hostages? <laughs> <laughs> the bus goes inside the hospital with a bunch of kids. That's fine, they go get into yeah. the swim to the No, that's how, that's how the magic school bus kills the villains. It goes into the villains' bodies and it just expands and explodes the person from the inside. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I think this bus is like secret to where it blends in with other buses. Okay. And this bus driver goes out to the like bus uh -huh. and it reveals its true form of being this like magical being. Okay. And all the kids go in it uh -huh. and basically bus driver lady. Miss uh, Frizzle. All right, so Miss Frizzle and her lizard <laughs> Ms. Frizzle, go and, correct. and Pure, take a uh, pension pet lizard. <laughs> <laughs> and whatever lizard that is. Which, as is uh, common in magic school with bus drivers. <laughs> <laughs> Take these kids, which by the way, the bus is like standing while it's like going Correct. down the hill. Correct. And yeah. I'll that know. count for space. Has it worked inside of the bus though? Are the kids like bouncing like Well, I, I, I think there's one They're word right. in the title of the show that you're, com you're looking over and it's magic. <laughs> Well, Everything is magic. Out. The answer to every question that you asked is magic. So are the kids inside of it also like stretching with the bus too? I, it's magic. <laughs> this doesn't explain anything. You can't just use it. It doesn't need to. And here's what the best part of it is. It's a magic school bus being used for educational purposes and scientific documentation videos. That's what I was going to say next. The, the bus driver takes them to like either go on like different adventures or just learn yeah. about like the world because it seems like they were everywhere. Yeah, so I, I think I think you're you're getting on Which the right path. Which is why I've seen this in school. Yeah, so you're getting school. the right path, exactly. So this series centers around science, biology, all that type of stuff. Miss Frizzle is actually their teacher. She's, she's a student's teacher and then yeah. she has this magic school bus that can change shapes, sizes, all that different type of stuff. It can fly into space, it can go into people's bloodstreams, into people's- So it does actually go inside someone. Yes. 
And now, I mean, it's magic, and you could argue that it's, you know, maybe all of the kids and the teacher are just on one big mushroom trip. But I mean, I think it's to each their own at that point. How <laughs> <laughs> you interpret the that cartoon is you and your own. That'd be, that's great. <laughs> I mean, there's eight seasons worth of to come through if you want to put together a theory. Oh yeah, there's plenty to go through. So I think I might stick with the acid show. <laughs> it's very excuse and magic. Yes, it's yes. very excuse and magic. Like, oh, they're yes. just all high. But that's what that's what I thought was one of the funniest things about the magic school bus. Was these are supposed to be like. You know, instructional videos. Obviously, you're supposed to entertain children, but you're supposed to learn about science or history or you know a lot of that different type of stuff. And they're doing it with a magic school bus that makes no scientific sense whatsoever. I always thought that was kind of a funny little trick. But why I picked it specifically is anyone who's even near my age range. I'm 30. Anyone who's in the ballpark of my age watch these in school they brought them in not like just once this was routine viewing when i was growing up in my school teachers like hell yeah pop that in eat an edible and i don't gotta do shit for 45 minutes <laughs> and I, I would do the same thing so, <laughs> and i had to watch a bunch of freaking kids so yeah like it's it's something that i think is very it was very prevalent in our age growing up i'm not sure if there's really anything comparable now gotcha. uh, teachers put on her bill nine he's also oh Bill yeah, Nye. I know that. Bill Nye, the science guy. Yeah, he was another one. Yeah, that's honestly one of the top two. That'd be another one that we watch all the time when we were in school. 100. Yeah. percent Bill Nye was a big one. I used to watch him when I was just sitting at home because I was a big dork. Well, no, it's like it's weird that Bill Nye's come back. He had his what well, was a Netflix show, right? And even this show, this show came back as a ne it came black came back as a Netflix Junior show. That's out now, and it looks like. Shit, but it's, <laughs> it, it's just a complete ripoff. It's literally it's Miss Frizzle's sister, younger sister, who's driving the bus. <laughs> Not creative at all. This is crap. This is a big show in my childhood in terms of growing up, and I'll never forget the the Magic School Bus. And yeah. as much as it doesn't make sense, Mason, it's a pillar in the memories of many young adults.